Okay. Hello, everyone. Today we are going to、um, rank the World of Tanks tier 10 tanks by their date of production. So first of all, we have the bullshit tanks that never existed, but World of Tanks, but War Gaming just decided to add them because stoinks. So we are going to throw some like by bullshit tanks. I mean like those tanks that. We're never even like implemented. Like it's just a drawing, or like it wasn't even a drawing. So, um, yeah. So those are called bullshit tanks. But if say stuff like E100, that thing was at least like built halfway. So we're going to count this one as not a bullshit tank. So yeah. So let's begin. So first of all, here we have dates, and then uh, let's put whatever I mean from what I know. So Mao's was like 1943. So let's put it here. E100 was 1944-45. Um, this one was also 45. On、uh, the GW E100, let's see what else I know right away. Um, the Liao. Oh, I don't remember the dates.、So. Um, let's see. Oh well, the that's the WZ121. That thing, that thing should be in 60s. Well, okay. Let's stop bullshitting. Let's actually Google. Okay, so. WZ one twenty one, um WZ one twenty one, uh wow、well, that's actually one twenty two but then yeah the Type sixty nine yeah that's the Type sixty nine, um sixty nine year, um okay that was nineteen eighty four two that's bomb okay that's nineteen eighty two wow that's unexpected, well the one thirteen I think the one well, I forgot the name of this thing well, um. Ah, I forgot the name of this thing. Well, the one twenty what? Ah, I literally forgot. Uh, Chinese tier ten times. Let's see. Uh, I wanna just now. No, not the one twenty. One twenty nine is a Type sixty nine. Yeah. Also, just in case if you guys are bored, just telling you that one twenty one Type sixty nine is actually Type fifty nine, but like second generation. So, oh, that's one thirteen. I'm pretty sure that shit never existed. I've never heard of it. So let's see. Wow. So vehicle. You support. However, project was cancelled. Okay. So that thing was never built. So we put that thing in the bullshit tanks. Ah,、uh, that's、um, WZ. Um, let's see the other one. Um. Where is it? Lol. Where Where did it go? Where's the other、uh, WZ thing? Oh, it's light tanks, isn't it? Oh yeah, one thirty two dash one. Let's see. Okay, also it's bullshit. See, World Gaming really likes bullshit tanks. This thing is definitely bullshit. This thing is not even a sketch. This thing is bullshit. Um. Okay, let's.、Mm -hmm. Yes, Kumit. Okay, yeah, we have also a guy that's、uh, MIT alumni. He's also with us. Um, yeah, so you guys can say hi to him.、Um, let's see else. Okay.、Mm. Where is it? Oh, there's 121B. I I'm pretty sure 121B was built also, isn't it? Yes, it was built. I'm pretty sure in the 60s. So developing the 60s because. Well, let's just go search like、um, Type 59、uh, with a、uh, 105 millimeter gun. Uh, let's see. So that's gonna be no, 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 not not that. Hundred fifty nine with type of millimeter gun. Well, well, definitely after seventy. So yeah. Oh, we don't even have it here. Oh well, sure. Okay, the one one dash five B. Where's the one one model five A there? Let's see one one model five A. So developed development can discontinue sixty four. So but there's one but that thing I remember I read a documentary about it. So um well it's sixties yeah. So only the hall was built. The turret wasn't because this thing was way too complicated for like Chinese. Um, factories at that time, so it wasn't. It was never built, which is well, no one needs tanks anyways. Okay, now let's 
check the uh, now let's check the uh, Czech tech tree the TVP T5051 um, let's see so that thing was built on discontinued on March 4 no prototypes were manufactured so that's a bullshit thing uh, there Oh my god, okay, now go so totally bullshit tanks. Let's go check. Let's go check them out. That's France. No, okay, now we have time. Oh shoot. Okay, that's the uh, EBR 105. Am I correct? That's the EBR 1. Yeah, that's the EBR 105. Um, um okay. So, featured. Never saw mass production, but was it developed? Let's go see. Maybe it was. I mean, as far as it was developed somehow, we are going to count it in. Okay, in the 80s. Wait, no, 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 that's not a way to look at it. Mm. Okay, what is that? Um, yes. Um, so produced well 51 to 60s well let's let's just put right here because yeah okay AMX 50 I'm pretty sure it was in 50s because that's why it's called AMX 50 well let's go um okay AMX 50 oh also we're going to count the very first prototype like what what time was it it's not like the last one because you know a lot of tanks are still in service um so when was it developed? In well, in late fifties, yeah. But then it was cancelled. But there was like prototypes built, so that counts. Let's see the Bachatilion twenty-five ton. The Bachatilion twenty-five ton. Twenty-five T, not twenty-five ton. Well, maybe it is. I don't know. Also. This one was like, I remember it had like prototypes, so and in the mid 50s, so it would be a good thing to say it's in 55 because you know a lot of information are lost like with the time. Um, let's see. Oh, the budget, the artillery. Let's see. The artillery. Um, so. Wow, I never knew it used the M47 chassis. But if you guys didn't know, the budget Leon used the M47 chassis. That's interesting. Let's see. Uh, yeah. Okay, why is our MIT alumni here again? Instead of doing research, he's also researching tanks. Yes, yes. So was it produced or no? Like what the heck? It doesn't say anything. No, no, no. I'm at you. I'm not talking with you right now. Um. Well. But anyways. Oh well, tanks are engineering. I'm doing history, you know. So this thing is bullshit because there's literally no information. Okay, the fo the the fosh. Well, I call it fuck because it is f f word, but it's actually fosh b. But we'll call it fuck because who cares? Okay, the fosh. Um, well, there's ob obviously no information about it, but let's see. No, 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 another guy, another guy, another tank. I don't, I don't want the guy. Oh, it's in 1954. Okay, good. 1952. So that's in early 50s. Wow, we finally have something. Is that the Fosh B? Well, I'm pretty sure it's on the same timeline. Or is that literally the same thing? No, that's not literally the same thing. AMX 30. Okay, this one definitely existed. Like, it definitely existed. It was in August 1964. 1962. Well, well, you see, I cannot even read. Um, well, the M445, I'm not sure that one existed, but well, let's see. 
whether we can find some good information on the Wargaming website. And 445. Uh, let's see. Okay, obviously Wargaming bullshit again, but then instead of reading Wargaming bullshit, let's actually search. Yep. Pretty sure it's bullshit. But just in case. Yeah, I see a drawing. Ah, <laughs> no, freak you, it's from the Wargaming. Yeah, so, okay, we can consider it a bullshit tank because, yeah. Okay, this one definitely existed. AMX, uh, AMX 13. Well, let me just Google AMX 13 because do you know the modification doesn't count? I'm pretty sure the ex that exact modification didn't exist because Dune is wargaming, but still. Um, so, it was produced from 52 to 87, so we're counting the very first AMX 13, which is actually level 6, but still, do you know I'm pretty sure the 105mm was never installed because, you know, I've never seen any documentaries that features that thing. So, it was in the 1952. Okay, this one definitely never existed, it's Pusha Tank. Um, let's see, how about the... Um... Okay, now we're in Germany again, which is very interesting. Um, yeah, so... We have a rain, rain metal uh, panzer wagon. That one was actually a. The proposal. So it's also a bullshit tank, yeah. So war gaming, thank you. It's a bullshit tank. This one's also a bullshit tank. This one's also a bullshit tank. This one's also a bullshit tank. tank. Well, Leopard one of course exists. That's one of the. Most, you know, like uh, iconic tanks of that uh, period. Leo uh, Part One. Yeah, that was a good, like, good, good. Okay, so 65. Well, sure. 1965. Okay, this again is again a bullshit tank. I'm 100% sure because it's bullshit. What is this? Is that a new tank or what? Well, Honestly, I'm pretty sorry. I didn't play War of Tanks for quite a while, so well, I'm playing War Thunder and League of Legends is also kind of because you know, for a tech guy, people don't play other games other than some like IQ games like War Thunder. But still, like War of Tanks has a lot of tanks, and it will be very interesting to you know find out the table. Also, if you guys well, but any anyways. If you guys want to see the whole table completed, if you don't guess, if you guys don't want to waste the time, you guys can just scroll to the very end. But still, um, let's just continue. I'm pretty sure that's a Poland tank, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, I'm correct. That's a Poland tank. I'm almost sure it is a bullshit tank. I'm like almost sure because Poland has freaking no tanks, okay? It looks like an IS-3 combined with a freaking Conqueror. Um, project kind of tank. So, well, 60 TP is also a bullshit tank, congratulations. Type 5 Heavy, also a bullshit tank. I mean, what Japan built, like, the, the, the best thing they built right there is the Chiri which never saw battle, and Type 5 Heavy definitely was a bullshit tank. Mm. Oh, STB-1, okay, that one definitely existed, I think it's still in service in Japanese army. Uh, it was in 1968, yes. So, this one, it was in 1968. It was right after the Leopard. Um, okay, STRV, STRV, is that one definitely also existed? I think it's still in service. Well, I am not sure about that one. Let's see, STRV 103. So, it was in 1967. Wow, see, all like a lot of tanks were in service in like 1960s. 
Um, all the crime wagon. I'm pretty sure this one did not exist because those countries, you know, they they don't make tanks. Like, well, let's see. I don't know. Um, the dummy turret was produced. Sure, you know, like if E100 counts, then this one should count too. Honestly, I wasn't I wasn't expecting that thing to happen, but dude, that's like 1949, bro. Pretty impressive for the um for this country to like make a tank by itself. Um, let's see. Okay, let's go. Let's go to let's go to the British right now. I'm pretty sure there's a lot of I just look at it and see a lot of tanks that actually existed, which is pretty like you know good thing. Um, let's see. Let's go British. Where's Britain? Brit UK. Okay. Um. So, for first we're gonna look at the uh light tank, the Manticore, which is also a bullshit tank. Okay, the Manticore is a bullshit tank. Well, as you can see, we have more bullshit tanks than actual tanks in this garbage game. Okay, so 215B definitely existed. I read an article about it, but let's just check. About the exact time of um, uh, Wikipedia. About the production. Oh, it doesn't have. Wow. Nothing? Never saw production. So basically a bullshit tank. Wow. Wow, interesting. That's a bullshit tank also. Um, well, let's see the con conquer fa the conquer uh, gun carrier. The conquer GC. Let's see. The conquer gun carriage. Interesting. Also bullshit tank. Okay, that's also a bullshit tank. Okay, FB, please tell me at least you existed. Oh my god, one of my favorite tanks before it got deleted. Please tell me you existed. Please. Don't disappoint me. Let's see. Um. Okay. I saw the time based on the Conquer chest with the project never saw military service. Where there was a dummy vehicle built, so dummy vehicle counts. It's better than nothing. Uh, okay, four thousand five. That one was definitely built because there's actually an actual model um, in a museum. Um, yes, in nineteen seventy, in nineteen fifty five. So yeah, oh by the way, just in case you guys didn't know, this thing was built to counter the Soviet IS-3 because um, the Soviet IS-3 was like posing a threat, threat because it was so armored and had a, such a good gun and the rest is like, what the fuck? Um, okay, let's continue our... Um, let's continue our... Um, shit. Okay, let's go look at the Super Conqueror. So that's, well, that's uh, like first half of the 50s, so, well, the Conqueror was like, had service, so, it was like, well, some people even say that it could be compared to like T-64, which I don't think so, because T-64 is a new generation of tanks, not like Conqueror, that's still first generation. The Centurion AX, let's see. Mm -hmm. Centurion Action X. So that's basically uh, cell ballistic trials. Okay, so there was one thing built. That's something very interesting. That will count. Centurion Action X. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Let me see. So this one we'll have to deduct because there's really no year of when it was built. But aha, uh -huh, so it's 1953. So okay, got it. So that's gotta be later than the 53. 
So 1955. Uh, Badger. I'm pretty sure Badger is a bullshit tank. Let's actually see. Because yeah, I mean, do you know we should not be like that. Um, sure, because some tanks are not actually bullshit, like as opposed to a lot of stuff. Does it say anything that the Badger... Yeah, Badger is a bullshit tank. I'm so sorry, but Badger, you're going to live with other bullshit tanks. Okay, we have finally the very last British tank in this whole... Um, that's a chief thing. This one definitely e existed. So... It started in the 51. Let's actually see when the chief thing entered the service. Oh my god, my spelling is done. It during the 60s, so in 1966. Wow, that tank took like 15 years to complete. Uh, oh, Sheridan. Oh, well, that one definitely served. Uh, Sheridan. Let's see. Sheridan, uh, in served since 1969. Okay, since Sheridan, we go 1969, yes. Uh, Patton, well, Patton also served, of course. Well, see, there's a lot of real tanks in American tech tree. Uh, which is surprising, you know? Russian game, American tanks are real. Well, because American, because it's a Russian game, that's why, Amer uh, that's why American tanks are real. It was actually 1948, because no wonder why it's called M Patton M48. Oh, the T92, let's actually see the T92 tank. The T92 is a gun carrier thingy, the, the, yeah, the howitzer um, machined uh, thingy. Oh, oh, it was actually produced, which is not surprising, because so far, all American tanks are real, which is very, very interesting. Um, so it was built. Wow, it was actually built in 1945. That's very, very interesting. So, where's our T92? So, it's somewhere right here. So, the dates are going that direction, if you guys didn't know. The bullshit tanks are just bullshit tanks. I'm not even getting anything for them. Because they're literally bullshit. If I was like born in the 30s, I would like, just draw a tank and send it to some archive. So, Wargaming will discover it now, and it will add it to the game, so yeah. Okay, uh, let's see the T-57 Heavy. It was... It's experimental, but it was at least partially real realized. So this was 1951, and then, so, um, counts, you know? And the T-110E5. Let's see, T hundred ten E five. Like so far, we we are actually like, surprised. All American tanks are real. That's very very interesting. There's one mocap build, so we will um. Okay, so the E five was a turret. Wow, interesting. So the E5 was actually built like a turret. I'm pretty sure it's in the 50s, isn't it? Because, yeah, that's in the 50s, that's early 50s, yes. Because, you know, it features the design of that time. So the E3 also existed, somehow, like, at least something was existed. So, the main, like, partial existed counts, you know? Uh, E3 also existed, which like, bro, like, every American tank is real. The, well, oh well, doesn't matter. Now we see the, is that the M60, if I'm not mistaken? Wait, where, where did our pattern go? Where's our pattern? Oh yeah, wait, I think I'm, I got just confused. One of them is pattern, another one is one, one M60. Okay, let's, okay, 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 wait, 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 wait. I just did some very bad job. Um, we actually mixed up the M60 and the um, pattern. 
So the M60. Oh no, we didn't. So we're good. We're good. So that's the. Uh, this is M60. It has a see the signature turret on the top of it. It it went to service in 1959 and saw battle in. All the wars later, which went against T62 and all the stuff, which you know, like it, it's still in serve in some countries like Taiwan. I'm pretty sure Taiwan still has M60s. Um, what is that? I don't know. Is it okay? Now we're officially entering the Soviet bullshit time. Most tanks that are Soviet here are bullshit. Like, except the ISL, nothing actually existed, I went to the museum and took a picture with it, so... Interesting, but it existed. So, now we're going to the... Soyuz Yes. Um, so, very firstly, we have, um... We have a, like, T-100LT, which never existed. Very sorry mate, but this is a bullshit tank. Um, let's see what else we have in Soviet tech tree. Uh, USSR. Uh, let's see, the T-62A. Well, obviously. Obviously. Where's my T-62A? I'm not seeing it. I'm, yeah, this is a T-62A. Yes, it is. It looks like a T-50... No, wait, it has another gun, isn't it? Dude, it's so confusing. What? No, okay, no, this one, this one looks... Bullshit. So I will assume this one is... No, this other one looks like Object 140. Wait, what? Whoa, 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 wait, I'm kinda confused right now. Yeah, yeah, okay, so T-62A... Is this one right here? Of course, sixties. That's why it's called T sixty two. Um. Let's see the object one forty. Okay, that one definitely exists. Well, it was developed. I saw the model of it, and it was like out. It was beaten by the. Uh, it was beaten by the T sixty two A because the T-62A was like more potent. So the object 140 was beaten by the T-62A. This one, the object 140. It was in late 50s, so yeah. Um, let's see, okay, I'm pretty sure all other tanks here are complete bullshit. The um, object 277, it actually is not bullshit. Can you guys imagine that? Two prototypes were built. That's very interesting. That's surprising. And that was in late 50s, I guess. Am I correct? Oh yeah, that was like very, very late 50s. So even in 60s. Um, let's see. Wow, like Soviet has some tanks. Like unlike other nations which were like almost purely bullshit um let's see let's see let's see the object oh wow now I have a bunch of objects the 705 bullshit tank of course i mean all the tanks that doesn't look like a tank is a bullshit tank that's what i'm saying um let's see the object 260 Uh, bullshit tank? Yes, it's bullshit. Which is not... Well, I'm pretty sure that thing looks really like IS-4, but... Probably got out-competed. I don't know. Um, let's see, the, um... IS-7. Well, let's actually look at the year. It was built in 1946. Wow, that's very impressive for Russians. That, that was a tank that, you know, can, can you guys imagine? Well, well, can you guys even imagine this shit? We have tanks from 1945 which are in this game. They're competing against tanks that are producing 9080. So, you know? Yeah. Tank diff. 
tank div, like big tank div. Yeah, like big tank div. Um. Okay. Uh. Now let's look at the uh, object. Uh. T22 medium. The T22 medium. Let's see. Um. Well, the whole of producing in 60 in 49. So that counts. You know. Where's my dirty gold, bro? I'm a blinder. Uh, Hall is producing 49, so yeah. Um, and then... Let's see at other Russian tanks. Um... Okay, we have the object 430. Let's see whether it actually existed. Well, it was. It actually, um, yes, it was competing against the T fifty four. I mean, to replace the T fifty four. So, um, sure, like nineteen fifty seven. Um, let's see the other tanks. Right in here. The um, okay, now the next tank we're looking at looks very, very bullshit, but despite that, we're not gonna like take it off right, like right away. We're gonna see like what kind of deal is it. But I'm not blind, what is that? I'm really sorry, guys, I didn't play like war, what for a while so. This is a new tank apparently. This is apparently a new tank. Um, was in 1949. But did it exist? Yes. I told you guys, it looks bullshit. That means it is a bullshit. Okay, now we're. F oh! Oh, 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 oh! Before we go to the bullshit tank destroyers. We actually need to give um, some credit to the object 279. That's a legendary tank. It was in made in like 1948. Um, this thing was actually built, even though this looks like the most bullshit tank in the whole world of tanks, but this thing was actually built. It could like resist a nuclear blast. That's why it's shaped like a UFO. So yeah, even though it looks like a complete bullshit, but this one is actually real. Like, I, I went to the Kubinka Museum and took a picture with it as well. So, cool, cool. See, Object 268. Yes. Object 268. Um, so, basically... Never existed. Extremely sorry. But... Model 4 never existed. Um, the regular, okay, okay, this one definitely existed, I saw that in fucking museum, so yeah, fuck that shit. But, okay, the gun, though, uh, was not, like, as powerful as in the game, it's like, it's just a better version of the ML-10, so. Um, yeah, so it was made in 1956. But do you know, like, at that time, like, tank destroyers were like, oh my god. Tank destroyers were like outdating, so no one needed a tank destroyer anymore. Um, okay, we're literally a few tanks left. The object 261. Mm. Yes. Well, good idea. Never realized. IS4 was definitely developed. Because, well, I also I saw that with my own eyes. So yeah, it was in building 1946, but it wasn't building large numbers because it wasn't that good of a tank. So, well, why is Patton over the Patton the latest? And this one's the latest. Okay. Uh, now we have some few more Russian bullshit tanks. Um, I'm almost certain the tank we're looking at 
is not real. But then let's see the object 907. The object 907. Um, the hole was made. Wow. Okay, it's not a bullshit. So sure, sure, interesting. That's interesting. By the way, if anyone knows what's the difference between object and project, oh, okay, sure. I'm pretty sure, like, just by my intuition, I can say the object tanks are those are actually like kind of made, and the project is just a project. So, yeah, makes sense. Oh, this one was also in the 75 plus. Of course, you know the Chinese tanks are like 75. Like China never had any fucking tanks by 75. So yeah, this one's definitely. Okay, let's stop saying definitely, let's actually see, because we already fucked up like a few times already, so let's stop saying definitely. Um, the ST2. Ha! Huh? Bullshit tank. Told you guys. Okay, now we only were left with very, very unpopular garbage tanks that I actually don't know. So, maybe they were just added later, like, yeah, the, I just don't know. Development of project was discontinued, the Progetto M40. Yes, very sorry, garbage. Well, this one could be fair to adding the real tanks because at least the model was built, but, you know. Model doesn't count. I can also build a tank model. Mm. Okay, let's go to Sweden. Because, yeah. Uh, Sweden. And the tier 10 um, S tier Vs. No, that's not 103B. That's a UDS 1560. Uh-huh, full-scale prototype was built. Interesting. Mm. So, existed. I mean, prototype was built. That's so much better than 50% of the tanks we have, like, in this game. Let's actually see the year it was, like, built, because that's very important for us. Um, in 1974, wow. In the 1974. Oh yeah, finally we filled our table up, yay! Uh, that's very very interesting. Um, let's see. Wait, isn't that a T110? Did I miss it or somehow? I'm not sure what I just did, but I think just missed something. Um, that's, no, that's T95E6. The T ninety five E six. It was building ninety sixty. Okay, dummy vehicle, but something better than nothing. At least not a child's drawing. Okay, the very last tank, and we are finally done after forty minutes of researching. Well, yeah. So hi to those people who literally came to the very end. I'm happy to see you guys. Um, yeah. Wait, what the heck is that? What is that? That's, is that American? No, that's not American. Like, a, how many pushy tanks did they add to this game? I'm just like... Shocked. Interesting. Okay, so what country could that be? Poland? Oh yeah, it is Poland. CX-63. CX-63? Okay, so that's a bullshit tank as well. Uh, so that's a bullshit tank as well. So in... Yes, we are finally done! Okay, now, okay, guys, let me just make this thing a little bit smaller, or we can't. But well, here, you can look at the whole beauty 
of our 40 minutes of work. Extremely interesting, right? So yeah, so now we can see, you know, our tanks from 40, 40s are competing against tanks from 80s. And they're beating competing. Like, do you know the E100 was never bad? Honestly, the stats are bullshit. Like, do you know the mouse never had that 250mm of armor, for example? But you know, it's pretty interesting to see. You guys can come to your own conclusions with this. But yeah. Uh, let me actually take a screenshot of this. So I'll be a oh my lord. So I'll be able to look at this beauty later. Um, 19, let me just take a screenshot of this. Well, I don't care about the BS vehicles actually. Okay. So yeah. Uh, thank you guys for watching. And yeah. Uh, if I come up with any other ideas and I see no one else on YouTube has done it, then I will do it. Okay, later guys.